Good morning. Uh, U.S. stocks continue to plant uh, on the prevailing fears of uh, extended uh, government shutdown. And the Dow uh, down another 414 points on last Friday, and the Nasdaq down 195 points and already entered the bear market territory. Um, the Hang Seng Index managed to uh, have the moderate gains on last Friday, uh, uh, up uh, 129 points, uh, mainly uh, boosted by uh, strong performance of uh, Tang Seng, which uh, have uh, seen the share price uh, going up by 4% in a single day. And the um, um, Hong Kong shares in uh, ADL's market uh, down 327 points. And the, um, I think that the um, uh, investor expecting that there may be some more uh, concrete measures uh, to be coming up from China following the uh, Central Economic Work Conference, which ended on last Friday. And the major messages uh, from the, the conference, including that the um, government will roll out uh, more support measures to boost the economy, especially in the advanced manufacturing sector. And also the uh, government will uh, vigorously support the private sector and resolve the financial uh, difficulties of private firms. Uh, but uh, overall, the uh, uh, market sentiment remains relatively uh, bearish, and the uh, VIX index continues to stay at a relatively high level, is more than 30. And so, the, in the absence of uh, fresh uh, news and uh, uh, Investors will take crews from uh, the U.S. stock futures in Asia uh, for short-term trading. And the, um, um, we expect there will be some uh, window dressing activities on individual stocks. But overall, uh, the uh, Hang Seng Index will continue to move between the range of 25,000 to 26,000. And then uh, that will and the remaining days of this year. Uh, and uh, overall, the uh, holiday mood is still prevailing uh, because uh, the Hong Kong stock market will be closed in the afternoon. And so I will take this opportunity to wish you all Merry Christmas. Thank you.